Hey guys, what's up? My name's Hydroponic Caravan. And let's read a Yu-Gi-Oh! and Bobo 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 crossover by Livy Kitty Don Patch the Duelist. Rated T with four reviews. Uh nothing there's there's no way this could be bad. Yeah, sorry, I really I had to take a break from the Naruto crossovers. So we're going to read bad Yu-Gi-Oh! crossovers instead. Fun. I wonder what would happen if Adam taught Don Patch to play Duel Monsters, Kit wondered aloud. Suddenly, Don Patch, Beauty, and Liv's crazy sister, Mylodia, appeared. Hit Kit, Mylodia yelled. Then Atem and Liv appeared. Hit Kit, hit Melodia, Liv yelled. For some reason, Liv is always loud when her sister was there. Okay, what the hell? Where are they? Kit asked, seriously pissed off. You asked what would happen, and now you're going to find out, Liv squealed. This'll be fun! Do you want to learn duel monsters? Atem asked Don Patch. Sure, Don Patch said. Knowing DP, this will be weird. No, I'm, 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 n no, I'm not going to make the DP joke. It's too easy. Like, it, it's... It's like a wounded gazelle limping across the Sahara Desert with a huge target sign painted on it. And the line just says, Really? This shit isn't worth my time. That's just pathetic. Continuing on, Why am I here? Beauty asked. Existential question, Beauty. That's great. To eye pop with Kit. She gets lonely being surprised by eye popping stupidly alone, Mylodia explained. Let's get started, Adam said. Then DP was in a military outfit. Beauty and Kit's eyes popped out. This is playing a children's card game, Kit yelled. Not war, Beauty yelled. Atem explained attack and defense. Then the dual spirit of Karibo and winged Karibo appeared. Aw, how cute, Beauty said. Then Don Patch stabbed the Karibos. Did you just stab the Karibos? Even though I hate them, I am enraged, Adam yelled. What's this? I'm enraged! Adam summoned Dark Magician. Stab Don, Adam yelled. DM did as his master told him. I'm feeling stabby, DP said calmly. After much popping and trading, Atem and DP had a duel. DP summoned the three Egyptian gods and Exodia in one turn. Did you summon four powerful monsters in one turn, Adam asked? DP was in a Seto costume. Oh, are, are you... really? I mean, the Trojan's card game bit was a good reference. Really, you're gonna, you're, you're gonna go here? Come on, man. What, what, I don't even know what your name is, god. Come on, Livy Kitty. Get yeah. Be classier than that. Do I, do, do I have to read this? Yes. Screw the rules. I'm a rich billionaire bastard. DP yelled. Meanwhile, a Kaiba Corps, my Kaiba imposter senses are tingling. Seto said suddenly. Say what? Said Mokuba. Back to Atom. Atom was beaten by Don Patch. I only lost because someone stole my leather. What? No. No. I like little Karibo as much as the next guy, but seriously? The references need to stop, man. These aren't funny anymore. Uh, uh, I only lost because someone saw my leather pants, Atom yelled. I did, my Lottie screamed, and I look smoking. Okay, Beauty said. This was the weirdest day of my life, Kit said and walked away. Uh, let's see what the fanfiction.net community has to say about this. Duelist Wing says, this was hilarious. Dark Lord Zork, okay, I already know this is going to be a rabid abridged fan. Nice, poor Tom, he's always losing his leather pants. Also, I take this fic was inspired by Atom's cameo in the actual Bubba Bo manga. Andy's anime says, well, this was interiasting. Fanfic supporter says, best story ever. My Kaiba imposter senses are tingling. Now that was funny. No, no, it wasn't. Actually, this isn't as bad as some of the other stories I've read. But, uh, Bobo -bo and Yu-Gi-Oh! Why are you smoking, man? I mean, at least you actually have a good hang on grammar. I kind of get what she, he, it was going for here. With It was kind of trying to make it like the randomness of... Bobo, but it doesn't translate into text at all. It's too slow with text. You can't pull that those sort of jokes off. 
Uh, USA. He's written 11 stories for Tokyo. Mew Mew. Exovers. Italia Axis Powers. And Bobo Bo. Not much, much to be said except K slash I and Yoi for DIE! No! 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 Yoi is horrible! And, uh, really join the dark side, we have cookies. Man, I remember making that joke in like the fourth grade. That's. No. Uh, you ate just a Bieber. Join the anti Bieber club. More anti Justin Bieber jokes. Uh, I, I, I don't know, this is, no, ASCII art, seriously man, ASCII art, come on, uh, why, why do people, look, look at this, look at this, it just keeps going, it doesn't stop, so, so much copy pasta, so much, this is ridiculous. Libby Kitty, you are a copy pasta maniac. Oh my god. And, oh yeah, and by the way, uh, by the way, stories. Okay, really? Did, did you need to make Italia? Uh, nothing is safe. I think this website is intentionally trying to make me hate everything I once loved about anime. My god. I don't even like anime that much, but I mean, it's just taking all the one. Okay, they they have a soul eater section, don't they? Let me guess, they've got a soul eater section. A story, I guess. Oh my god! No! No! Uh, shoot me. Just, just shoot me. Thanks for watching, guys.